Hey guys, welcome back to ATZ TV. Thank you for stopping by for another video. And Hugo Pomus is leaving ISL, and it's a very shocking thing. But I'll sum up to you all what is happening and what's wrong with him. Okay, in this video. But if you're new to the channel and you'll enjoy football content, first check those videos. I've covered Ashadi uh, Singh's deal uh, from Odisha to FC Goa. I've covered Jesu Raj's deal from uh, Chennai to FC. I mean, from FC Goa to Chennai. So please check those videos also. Uh, now we'll talk about uh, you know uh, the big big bad guy. I think the most hated foreign player in ISL at the moment, Hugo Bomas. He's hated by FC Goa player fans. He's hated by Mumbai City fans, and currently he's hated by ATK Mohun Bagan fans. Things can't go worse for him. Okay, so what's all about him? I will explain in this video. But first, let us go a little bit into detail of his current situation. Okay, at ATK Mohun Bagan, that is his stats and all about him. So. Uh, yeah, of course, is his player data, and uh, as you can see, he was born in 1995. That means he's 26 years, uh, still a young player. Um, okay, double citizenship, attacking midfielder. He's very renowned for his attacking midfielding. He's the highest assist assist player in ISL. Currently, he's at ETK Moon Bagan and has a contract till 2026, which is quite a long time. Like uh, about I think five more years or four, four, five years more. Uh, but the issue here you all may ask is why is he going to leave ATK Moon Bagan and he's a valuable player you can see he's about uh, five covers his value is about five covers so and he has about four years more left in his contract with ATK Mohun Bagan so why is he leaving you all may ask well the situation is very dire okay the thing is Hugo Bomas's ego is affecting his football is playing football and also outside football okay with the coach staff other players management there's a lot of issue you can just see it with his current stats okay just look at it he has played 15 games in isl okay he has got just five goals just six assists for a player who's as who's one no renowned as one of the best assist merchant who can give one of the best assist top assist assist uh, maybe no, missing by a assist or two here and there for the top spot but one of the best assist player uh, you know playmaker uh, goal scorer also yet he somehow has such a low stat and see he's not even a common regular starting 11 player anymore he has just started 74% of all ATK Moon Bagan's match for a player Remember, for a play, ATK Moon Bagan has played two covers for. He has just played 74% of the matches, 63% uh, of available minutes, and 30% of goal participation from him. This sounds as a good player, okay? It sounds good when you have so much participation, goal scored, and all. But let me remind you Hugo Bomas costed ATK Moon Bagan about two covers to sign him. He, they brought a, a from Mumbai City uh, Hugo Bomas for about two covers, and because of that, they missed on the deal for you know Aupuya, who also costed somewhat similar to that uh, you know cost. So you can see ATK Mumbai lost a good reliable young uh, Indian player, and currently the Hugo Bomas who have signed has performed well in the start of the season, but has completely uh, gone missing in recent uh, games. So, of course, some of you may say, hey, he's very good in as a playmaker. Uh, goals may not be his strong point. Well, for you all, I got Sofasco, another, uh, uh, you know, so, uh, app or, you know, website that covers every single aspect of a particular player. So now, according to Sofasco, he has got five assists, okay? So, I don't know which will be correct, you know. Is uh, in, in the transfer market correct with six or Sofa? I don't know. Maybe there may be a dispute about one assist. So, that's not so uh 55.6 touches he has per match okay big chances created four okay uh key passes 2.5 his passing accuracy has gone very low just to 77 uh, percent while uh, pa uh, passing in his own half which means in uh his d in i'm uh, not his d in his side okay where his goalkeeper is that side uh it's just is 90 percent which is very good you know uh considering that uh he passes very well but here when he is in the opposition half means uh, while going to attacking okay while going attacking his percentage drops to 64 percent which is very bad considering he's one of the best assist uh, playmakers okay so he should be you know giving easy assist and also 
that's sad okay uh, accuracy of long balls again dropped lower to 60 percent uh chip passes again 32 percent and crosses have been the lowest at 24 percent so you can see the ego of the ego of hugo boomers one according to me one of the biggest things that affect his performance is the fact that uh you know he is so bad you know uh, sorry for that lighting issue <laughs> so uh you know his uh, crosses are going bad his passing rate is dropping what is happening to hugo bomers so there are some few more things that you all uh, need to know okay and this was reported by one of my uh, good subscriber and also he is very into depth about news so he told me this on insta this has come from news times bangla uh, it reports as hugo bomas is moody short temper having a bad boy image in an uh, immogless atk moon bagan management he was the reason behind habas's resignation now he is creating problem again he had huge call with coach uh, juan fernando after odisha match still he has not he has not not been given a show cause notice yet since the team is in championship round but it won't be surprising if team remove him after this season so first of all uh, as i told you all the ego of hugo bombers is his biggest problem okay and uh, we can see that now okay uh, about his uh, ego so uh, you may ask me now what can be done in this situation you know uh, well there are uh, some uh, things that ATK Mohan Bagan of course Hugo Bomas is a very talented player on paper and if you can somehow uh, you know uh, sell him with his uh, you know uh, stats on paper is a very good deal first of all all Indian clubs know about him now about how bad his ego is and how it can affect the squad so no team is ready to take the risk with him so it looks like most probably he's going to play abroad you know in a different league so ETK Mohan Bagan have a few things that they can do they can get their money back by selling him to another club yes it may not they may not, may not be able to sell him at two covers but may be able to sell him at another decent price okay at least cut your losses uh, the second possible way is to terminate his contract uh, since if once you terminate mutual termination of contract of a player uh, you know you don't need to pay his salary which of course currently he, Hugo is getting a salary without doing anything so I think if uh, they can terminate his contract with that of course they won't get their two covers back but they won't have to pay the salary for Hugo Bomas. Also, Hugo Bomas will have to search for a new club. Another possible way is you can send him out on loan, which means you still he's a part of the club, still you have to play up maybe a percentage of the salary, but overall he's still going to play, you know, maybe come back, maybe he may learn his lesson and come when he comes back, he may be a better player. These are three possible things ATK Moon Bagan can do at the moment, but uh, I don't know which. If you know, guys, if you all feel, suggest me which one is best for ATK Moon Bagan, tell me in the comments. Thank you guys for watching this video. Do like, share, subscribe. Uh, hopefully, you all understood everything about the Hugo Bomas deal, and hopefully, you all enjoyed this video. Tell me your thoughts in the comments down below. I feel uh, Hugo Bomas. Uh, time in Indian Super League is over with this okay no other club is interested in him anymore so let's see what happens thank you for watching this video do like share subscribe see all the more ZT videos coming soon in the near future goodbye take care stay safe